I've known Elizabeth for some time, and Joe Zubiondo, her partner, who heads the California Institute of Integral Studies. And I've seen how over the last decade, that institute has grown and expanded and widened its horizons, come Kakuli, and been in touch with Orwell very closely. I happened to meet Elizabeth this summer in San Francisco, and she said that she was planning to come here for a sabbatical, for a resident period of residence, and we had spoken about having a kind of an exchange, an interchange on the divine feminine, how around the world we see the divine feminine, perhaps from different uh, perspectives of a prism, and yet somewhere the convergence is there. Uh, she has braved the trauma of the cyclone and come here and stayed here, and we had to postpone this evening with her by a week, but I'm happy we are able to meet before she leaves in a few days' time. If I may do so, I'd like to read out just about um, a dozen lines of a little poem which is entitled The Eternal She. And that perhaps gives a perspective under which a lot gets covered. So if you'd allow me, I'd just read that, and then Elizabeth would lead the evening for us. Aster, in the spirit of um, acknowledging the women and the authors of the great um, acknowledgement of feminine...